R equal to ABCD is given and R is decomposed into R1, ABC and R2, ADE and FDs are given AARO, BC, CDRO, BRO, DERO. We need to check whether R1 and R2 are lossless or lossy decomposition. When it is lossless, if we perform natural join between R1 and R2, we get the original uh, table R, then it is lossless and if we get any surplus tuple, then it is lossy. Mean R1 natural join R2 that is equal to R mean it is lossless and R1 natural join R2 not equal to R that is lossy. Now we need to find the candidate key that is A plus uh, equal to A to B C from B to D and from C D to E. Here we get R that is A is a candidate key. A is a candidate key. Now C D plus equal to C D E from E to A and A to B C. So C D is also a candidate key. Now B plus equal to B D and no further expansion is possible. E plus equal to E to A then A to B C and from B to D and E is a CK. So candidate key are CK equal to here A is a CK, C D is a CK, E is a CK. All one is R1 union R2. We need to find if R1 union R2 equal to R, then it is first rule is applied. Now R1 here, R1 is ABC and R2 is ADE. And union of this is that is equal to ABC DE that is equal to R. So first rule is applied. If this is false, then we can say it is lossy. If it is true, then we need to check next rule. We need to check R1 intersection R2 should not be 5. I mean here R1 if we perform intersection between A, B, C and R2 that is A, D, we get A that is not equal to 5. So rule 2 is also true. So if it is false then we can say it is lossy. As it is true as it is true so we need to check third rule. And third rule say that when we perform our intersection between R1 and R2 that can be a super key of R1 either R1 or R2. Here A is a super key that is a super key of R1 and as it is candidate key and we know the candidate key is a subset of super key so it is also true. So we can say we can say this decomposition is is lossless.